Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's you, absolutely Britain. ideal. I'm Derek Ray, joined on the commentary box by Lee Dixon. And what we have for you is live action from the Championship. It's Reading, and they face Luton Town. Well, thank you, Derek. Glorious atmosphere here. Really looking forward to it. The fans are too. The players look like they're up for it. This could be end-to-end. -end. We could get goals today, Derek. A glance at the Reading starting 11. Would you call it 4-5-1, Lee? Yeah, I really like this formation, Derek. 4-2-3-1, really. The two central midfield players supplying support to a three ahead of them and then a lone striker with a number 10 just behind him. This is the lineup for the visitors today. This particular setup is becoming more and more in favour. Yes, Derek, one central striker, two wingers who will provide the width, a very narrow three in midfield, a back four, the two full backs will be expected to support, but also defend and help out the centre backs. Thank you, enjoy the game. And they kick off here. Rinom Hota. Michael Morrison. Ejaria. Lucas Joao. Rinom Hota. Liam Moore. Moore. Morrison. Moore. Richards. Couldn't keep the ball. Ray. Mpanzu. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. Yaku Meite. Rinom Hota. Oh, that's a well-timed pass. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. And attempting the through ball. In it goes! The goal for 1-0, and that changes the dynamic. Well, here's the replay, and the passing move is almost unstoppable. The movement is key for me, and he chooses to use power in the finish. Not much chance for the keeper when it's hit that hard. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Berry, Craney, Martin Craney, Craney, Cornick, Berry, 
Pearson. Ruddock. Not showing good patience. Pelly, Ruddock and Panzu. Martin Craney. And the emphasis is on creativity. Mpanzu. No, high quality defending. Lucas Joao. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Ray. Still trailing, but they're upping the pressure. Berry. Collins. Well, a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Lucas Joao. Rinom Hota. Lucas Joao. Mastery of the passing game. And players waiting in the centre. Ejaria. Lucas Joao. And so it is, the first half story has been written. Well, this man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Lee. Well, Derek, you're right, he has played well and goals win games. He's been a joy to watch in this form. Sit back and enjoy him in the second half. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Berry. Ray. Martin Craney. Pearson. Craney. Pearson. They've given it away. Pearson Bradley Ray Pearson Collins Extremely sloppy in possession They've got it now, what can they do? Ejaria. Lucas Joao. Rinom Hota. Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. A really effective shielding under pressure. It looks promising. He's got to score! And that'll be offside. And a substitution in the offing. With Alan Keegan, that's Alan Keegan. Please come to reception. Your wife is waiting for you. Martin Craney. I oh, just couldn't keep the ball. Alfa Semedo, Rinom Hota,
fluency of movement. Lucas Joao. Rinom Hota. It's with Alpha Semedo. Lucas Joao. Well read to put an end to that attack. Lee. Inside the last quarter of an hour. Collins. Still behind, but the pressure mounting. Excellent defending. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Well, just listen to the atmosphere, Derek. It's been such a tight game, but can they see this out now? The fans are certainly doing their bit. What can he do from here? Richards. It's with Alpha Semedo. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Omar Richards. Real danger. Well read to ease the pressure. And it's a case of just five minutes left. And forward they go, chasing the game. Lee. And fed forwards. Collins. Well, nothing productive, really. The referee blows for full time. It ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, split by that one goal. That's how close the game was. Neither team deserved to lose, really. It was so tight. And I think it's accurate to say, Lee, that this man was the light bringer for his side. Well, he's always a danger, isn't he? No more so when he grabbed that goal. He never disappoints me when I watch him. He's just too good, simple.